Thanks to everyone who shared and posted their fan arts on the Discord server. You can submit your fan arts by joining my Discord server. The link is in the description below. Hello everyone and welcome back to another build hacks video. So a few days ago I made a community post about this video and judging by the comments I see you guys really like quartz but unfortunately we're not gonna focus on quartz instead we focus on the blackstone. The blackstone furnitures I see blackstone or black as elegant quite dark and gloomy but it looks luxurious if you agree with me but to be fair I also agree on your choices that quartz is better and I see why. Also shout out to the these amazing people thank you for supporting the channel you guys are amazing now let's get right into the video we'll start in the living room furnitures if you don't want a sofa made out of quartz which I think looks clean and looks modern but we can do a better version of this sofa or a different color of the sofa using the new 1.16 black stone we can create a black sofa and using armor stands and an iron helmet, we can create a pillows that will add details to the sofa. I think black sofa fits in on quartz or white concrete because it gives you that fine contrast look which looks very clean and neat. The next one, if you don't have that much room or space for the couches, we can create a one-seater sofa with a similar design to the bigger one. I decided to add some pillows as well so it looks very comfy and looks kind of the same as the big sofa that, that we did. And there we have a mini sofa. It looks even better when combined it with the big sofa. So you have two couches in your living room. Following the couches design, I made a black stone vase which looks nice to create an aesthetic black look to your house or to your living room. I honestly think this is a good detail to add if you're lacking of details. You can also change the flower design. Any flowers would look good and you can place it anywhere you like. And if that isn't enough for you to make your living room furnitures all black, we can create a realistic looking television with speakers using different kinds of blackstone black. Now I suggest building this to your modern homes or your quartz mansion because again, it creates this cool contrast to the living spaces and here is the example of what I'm talking about. Combining them with quartz makes it look much better. Let's now focus on the dining area of your house. If you're building a nether house or somewhat you really love blackstone, this table made out of blackstone gives you a premium kind of marble-ish look to your dining area. Plus with a little blackstone dining chair design that I created, we can create a really cool blackstone dining table furnitures. Following the dining table, if you're tired of looking at your quartz bookshelf, you can change that into a now modern looking blackstone shelf. Which again, it's perfect for when you're making an all-black house or you just want a black bookshelf design. And there we have a black bookshelf. So let's now move into the kitchen part of the house because I'm going to be showing you these 10 kitchen furnitures made out of blackstone. First kitchen furniture, if you don't want a classic all-white water dispenser, you can make an all-black water dispenser using blackstone and a dark oak trapdoor. The armor stand with dyed leather tunic is not gonna change, otherwise it won't look like a dispenser, but it's up to you if you want to change it. Let's create the water dispenser itself. I will be using a polish blackstone and a polish blackstone stairs so it has this smooth look but it's up to you if you want to use a different blackstone block. Now we want to grab the water in a blue stained glass because that's going to be our dispenser itself and there we have a black water dispenser design. Next, we'll do a black fridge design. It's up to you if you want a white fridge or the black fridge, because it depends on what kind of kitchen you're doing. If you're doing a kitchen with a bright ambiance like quartz, planks, or white concrete, then you need to stick to the quartz fridge. But if your kitchen ambiance uses dark colored blocks like gray concrete or dark oak planks, 
then stick to this blackstone fridge. The banners that we're doing is the fridge door. You can pause the video so you can follow. Once we're done with the banner, we can now place it on the right side of the fridge and there we have a blackstone fridge. Just like the fridge, we also have a black version of the microwave. You can choose if you want the quartz or the new blackstone look. Now I prefer using the quartz for modern slash clean look and the blackstone if you want a more elegant or a more dark look. Another difference when making this microwave is the banners. Since the color got changed, we're only going to change the middle part of the banner. You can pause the video so you can follow. I honestly love this new black microwave look. It looks very elegant and looks fancy. You can also create a black knife block or knife rack. If you look closely, the armor stand is the knife handle, which looks cool and gives you an idea that it's a knife rack. Now you will be needing 3 armor stand for the knife handle. This depends on how many armor stands you have. If you have 2 armor stands for instance, then you only do 2 knife handles. If you have 1 armor stand, then you only have 1 knife handle. It's quite hard to explain but I hope you get the point of what I'm saying here. And here we have a black knife rack to add extra details for your kitchen. Look at how beautiful these cabinets are, especially when combined with other kitchen appliances we made. The cabinets is actually a very simple build to make. This depends if you want a quartz or a black stone. The base of the banner is actually one color which is gray. The difference is the colors on the outside or the frame. Then simply place it just like that. If you want this really cool open cabinets, you'll need a stair. Depending on which block you chose, then place the cabinet banner at the side of the banner beside it. Now the cabinets are open, and I really love these open cabinets. It gives you some sort of realism to the kitchen. One of my personal favorites when doing a small detail builds is this cool little toaster. The toast that you see on the slab is actually a banner and you only need brown and orange dye to make the toast. When you place it and add the slab of your choice, you get this cool little toaster. I love this very clean modern dishwasher in white color. Let's see what it looks like on a black color. Now I actually did not use blackstone, instead I used the most expensive block on Minecraft which is the netherite block. And now we kinda turned the dishwasher into a very expensive dishwasher in Minecraft. <laughs> the banner will be the plates inside and the black carpet on top. Now we have the most expensive dishwasher in Minecraft. <laughs> Let's make a midi oven in Minecraft made out of blackstone. It is actually very easy to make. You just need a chiseled blackstone and the banners as the mini oven door. And just like that, we now have a mini blackstone oven. If you don't want a white stove, replace the iron block with netherite and dark oak trapdoor on top. The banners is similar but the difference is the color under it. You can pause the video so you can follow. And there we have a black stove. Don't forget to match your black stove with a black stone smoke filter on top. Now let's take things to the next level. If you don't want a white shiny toilet, you can go for a black marble toilet that looks elegant and very premium looking. Or you can simply call it blackstone toilet. You will be needing a netherite chest plate and a diamond helmet for this. I prefer this toilet if you are making a nether bathroom or you wanted a more elegant looking toilet. Now we have a blackstone toilet. To match your blackstone toilet, we will be making a blackstone bathtub as well. 
Let's start doing the base of the bathtub before doing the faucet. Let's now do the armor stand faucet in the front side of the bathtub. Oops, I almost forgot the black stone wall. Sorry. Now that the armor stand is in the middle, let's now cover it with polished black stone. Add two hook buttons on each side and there we have a bathtub faucet. Now we can continue with the rest of the bathtub. And there we have a blackstone bathtub. You can add water if you want or leave it as it is. And there we have an elegant looking bathtub made out of blackstone. If you want to make your bathroom all black, you might as well include the bath sink. Again, use armor stand for the faucet to make it realistic. After making the faucet made out of armor stand, we can now push the blackstone stairs onto the armor stand so it is covered. Continue with the rest of the blackstone. And there we have a realistic looking blackstone sink for your bathrooms. For our last blackstone furniture, let's do a blackstone shower head. I included a chain to the shower head for the design and the iron trap door as the main shower head. Black looks good in my opinion but you guys can change it if you want. And there we have a realistic looking shower head made out of blackstone. Unfortunately guys, that is it for the Blackstone build hacks. If you want more build hacks, then make sure to click subscribe and hit the notification bell so you don't miss out on some build hacks. This is Tuna, signing out.